tomb is empty. Jesus is alive. Amen. I hope you're excited about that. We ought not to have to ask you to be excited because that is the greatest news ever. Um, for those of you that know the Lord, you're going to be able to one day look forward to being right there with him in person in heaven forevermore. All because he gave his life. He died, but the joy, he rose again. Amen? So, we are super excited to be here with you today to celebrate uh, that beautiful reminder of what he has done, who he is, um, and more importantly, this is a time of celebration and praise to King Jesus. Amen? So, this first song is uh, kind of aligned with scripture in Psalm 150 that says, Let everything that has breath, what? Yes. So we need you to help us on this song simply called Praise. Let everything that has breath praise our Lord. Amen. Praise in the valley, praise on the mountain. I'll praise when I'm sure, I'll praise when I'm down. I'll praise when outnumbered, praise when surrounded. Praise is the water, my enemies drown.
It's not something I can keep inside. How about y'all? Yes, because he is too good. He deserves all the glory, all the honor, all the praise. This is good God Almighty. Y'all join as we sing this, lifting his name high. Good God Almighty, I hope you'll find me. Praising your name no matter what comes. I can't count the times I've called you name some broken night. You showed up and patched me up like you do every time. I get amnesia. I forget that you keep coming here out. Ain't no way you will ever let me down. Good God Almighty, I hope you'll find me. Praising your name no matter what comes. Cause I know where I'd be without your mercy. So I keep praising your name. all the time, right? Yes. All right. Oh, man. <coughs> Let's pray together before this next song. How about? Father God, I just praise you today. Thank you so much for choosing to go to that cross. Thank you so much as well for getting up and for offering a chance when we were nowhere near anywhere close to being worthy, a chance for everlasting life, a chance for salvation. The heart of you, Lord, is greater and beyond anything we could ever begin to imagine or understand, comprehend. It's so, so great. You see every part of who you created us to be. You see our unique being. 
You see that precious plan and purpose that you created for each and every one of us. And Lord, we just praise you today. We just praise you in every way. I pray you're glorified, Lord, as we continue to lift your name high. We love you, Lord, and thank you so much. It's in Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. A gray light dawns in Galilee. Some say madman, some say king. Wonder working rebel priest. Jesus Christ. The Nazarene. He knew well what it would take to free us all from sin and error. A perfect man would have to die, and only he. Friday's good cause Sunday is coming Don't lose hope cause Sunday is coming Devil you're done, you better start a running Friday's good cause Sunday is coming So we let the soldiers take him in. His friend betrayed him with a kiss. There before the mocking crown. Like a lamb to the slaughter didn't make a sound. Then he carried that cross to Calvary. He shed his blood to set us free. As the nails went in and the sky went dark, the redemption of the world was on his heart. Friday's good cause Sunday is coming. Don't lose hope cause Sunday is coming. Devil, you're done, you better start a running. Friday's good, cause Sunday is coming. And he breathed his last, bowed his head, the Son of God, and man was dead. With bloody hands, tears on their face, they laid him down inside. That wasn't the end. That wasn't the end. That wasn't the end. Let me tell you what happened there. The women came before the They looked inside the angel said, Why you looking for the living among the dead? He's alive, he's alive, hallelujah, he's alive. Give him praise, lift him high, hallelujah, he's alive. He's alive, he's alive, hallelujah, he's alive. Give him praise, lift him high. Don't lose hope, cause Sunday is coming. 
just say amen. Oh, thank you, Lord. <laughs> man, y'all. Are you looking as forward to his coming as I am? Maybe it'll be today. I wish. Right? Oh, my goodness. Until then, however, I just want to remind you with this next song that you were made for a specific purpose. He designed you and only you in a very specific way. Why? Because he wants to use you. He wants to use you in whatever situation you're in, wherever you work, whoever you come in contact with. And most importantly, you can't do that if you're worried about your past, if you're worried about your shame, your guilt. That comes straight from the enemy. Why? Because he made you for so much more than that. He doesn't intend us to live in defeat, to live in shame, to live with guilt. That's why he died. His blood washed all of our shame, all of our guilt, all of our defeat. We don't have to bring that back. Once it's gone, it's gone. So I encourage you to leave it. Leave it alone. Don't look back. You're here now. He wants to use you now in that purpose that you were made and created. So if you don't know this song, I pray that you will ask the Lord right now to let the words of this song really resonate with you, to speak to your heart this morning. I know who I am, because I know who Cross of salvation was only the star. Now I am chosen, free and forgiven. I have a future, it's worth.
Betting my shame when a fountain of grace is running my way. I know I am yours. I was paid for more. My goodness. Father, I thank you for calling our name. You called us out of the grave, out of the old. And God, I thank you that you buried my past. I don't like that guy. Where would we be without your mercy, Lord? I don't even want to think about that. So, Lord, you deserve first place in our life. You deserve all the praise that we can muster up. All the worship, all the glory, because we are nothing without you. So, Lord, I thank you that you woke us up today. You gave us another day. This springtime where flowers are blooming. Lord, that's your gift to us. We got flowers today. <clears throat> you may have never gotten flowers from another human being, but let me tell you something. Your Father God had given you flowers today. And more than flowers, Lord, you've given us breath in our lungs and you've surrounded us with a hope and a future. So, Lord, we celebrate you today. And I pray that this is not the only day of the year that we celebrate you. Lord, I pray as we move forward and we are reminded of the truth that's in your word. That you would give us ears to hear. Lord, that you would... Give us what each individual person needs today. And I just thank you for what you're going to do. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. And this Easter crowd, in a big way, said, Amen. Amen. That's what I'm talking about.